friends to solve problem on work energy principle what is given in this problem a force of 500 newton is acting on a block of mass 50 kg resting on horizontal surface as shown in figure determine its velocity after the block has traveled a distance of 10 meters let me first we'll draw a free body diagram of this block if we'll draw free body diagram what we'll get here say this one is a block external force is 500 newton inclined at an angle of 30 degree with horizontal this force will represent here 500 newton inclination 30 degree weight of block acts in downward direction as mass is 50 kg weight i will write as a 50 into g means acceleration due to gravity normal reaction acts in upward direction this is rn as 500 newton force is acting in rightward direction due to horizontal component of this force body moves in rightward direction that means displacement is in rightward direction therefore frictional force will get in leftward direction mu is a 0.5 therefore frictional force is 0.5 rf now to find out velocity of this block when block has traveled a distance of 10 meters work is done by 500 cos 30 and work is done by frictional force therefore first we'll find out normal reaction at contact surface to find out normal reaction and apply equation along y-axis summation of fy equal to zero assuming upward force is positive what forces acts in vertical direction the first one is rn next force is weight that acts in downward direction 15 to g is 9.81 i'll substitute here component of 500 acts in upward direction to 500 sin of 30 this one is equal to zero therefore normal reaction comes out to be if you calculate using calculator this value comes out to be 240.5 newton once we'll get normal reaction now easily applying work energy principle we will get velocity of this block displacement of block is in rightward direction it is given displacement as 10 meter rightward or leftward is not given but as 500 newton force is acting such that its horizontal component acts in rightward direction block has to move in rightward direction now if we'll apply here work energy principle applying wep from say position 1 to 2 this one is say position 1 and after 10 meters what position will get here is say position 2 our equation is what work done by forces when body moves from 1 to 2 is final kinetic energy that is ke2 minus initial kinetic energy is what ke1 now in work done by forces which forces acts in the direction of motion first one 500 cos of 30 acts in rightward direction motion is also in rightward direction therefore work done by 500 cos 30 is positive therefore 500 cos 30 into 10 meters minus why negative because frictional force acts in leftward direction motion is in rightward direction therefore 0.5 into rn again displacement is what 10 that means what you will get here work done by these two forces final kinetic energy means half m v2 square minus initial kinetic energy half m v1 square now this initial kinetic energy is given in problem 50 kg block resting on a horizontal surface that means v1 is zero as v1 is zero we'll substitute v1 as zero unknown term is only v2 that means what we'll get here 500 cos 30 10 i will take common 0.5 rn is 240.5 multiplied by displacement is 10 equal to half 
mass of this block is 50 kg substitute here 50 v2 square minus 0 that means unknown term is only v2 easily will get velocity of block after moving 10 meter if you calculate using calculator this velocity comes out to be 11.185 meters per second this is final velocity of block when block moves in the rightward direction a distance of 10 meters. Thank you.